when Joe Rogan asked Neil deGrasse Tyson why we haven't had a manned moon landing since 1972, he answered like this. Like this! <laughs> All right. What we were not reminding ourselves is that the only reason why we went to the moon is because we were at war with Russia, with the Soviet Union. That is the only reason at all. If you don't carry that motivation with you, and you're only thinking that this is simply the next technological thing to do, that when we learn that Russia is not going to the moon, therefore we have no reason to continue and we stop, you then, you, you cry foul and you say, well, wait a minute, how about the future? How about Mars? And how about the rest of that? Well, the rest of that was not ever in the plan unless Mars had planned to, I mean, <laughs> unless Russia had planned to do it. And so it was not a natural flow of what our technology would have done because it didn't flow out of our economic creativity. It came out of our urge to not die. And so when you have that scenario, of course we didn't go past the moon after 1972. We were no longer competing with Russia to do that. Now, if you've been paying close attention, you might have caught that Tyson said something very suspicious. Very suspicious indeed. Let's rewind to that particular moment to catch just exactly what Tyson was saying. You then, you, you cry foul and you say, well, wait a minute, how about the future? How about Mars? And how about the rest of that? Well, the rest of that was not ever in the plan unless Mars had planned to, I mean, unless Russia had planned to do it. Unless Mars had planned to do it. He said it. Unless Mars had planned to, I mean, Unless Mars had planned Mars 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 He said it and then he took it back and he and he fumbled and he was like Oh well Russia I mean like oh like if Russia had planned to do it or something <laughs> You know and he's trying to cover up that he said Mars but he said Mars because I think he knows something the rest of us don't. He and a small little group of elite government officials and scientific experts, the small group that knows there's life on Mars. He knows it. And he just let the cat out of the bag right there, man. He was like, oh, unless Mars was going to, what was Mars going to do? What? If, if there's only little microbes or little rats or something? No, he knows there's a civilization on Mars. Highly intelligent, highly advanced civilization with, with, with technology and science and these creatures on Mars, they have all that they have architecture, art, music, literature, public sanitation. They've got all of that and more stuff we could never imagine. And, and he knows it. Yeah, yeah, I caught that. <laughs> yeah, he can't hide that anymore. There should be an investigation into this life on Mars because, yeah, mm-hmm.